Good morning. My name is Masha Yurfiva Young. I am a master's level therapist, a life coach, and a spiritual practitioner. And I want to take the time in this video to give a little bit of information about myself, um, talk about the difference between life coaching versus traditional therapy, and then offer my input on what I believe that life coaching could do for you uh, and how it could benefit uh, your life. So I received my master's degree in Flagstaff, Arizona at Northern Arizona University in clinical mental health counseling and my bachelor's of science in psychology right here in our wonderful city of Rockford at Rockford University. And I'm currently working as a clinical mental health uh, therapist, but I also do offer life coaching services. So the difference between life coaching and more traditional therapy um, if you are a person who is dealing with a specific issue that, you know, requires an assessment, a clinical assessment, a diagnosis, and then a um, treatment plan, such as maybe clinical depression, addiction, uh, intense anxiety, you know, maybe OCD symptoms, things like that, then that is something that you do want to uh, contact a counselor, a therapist, someone who is you know, gonna make you a plan on how to deal with those things. But if you're someone that is, you know, kind of living day to day and thinking, I really just want more out of life. There's something isn't clicking, something isn't right, you know? Nothing is maybe horrible, but things aren't as good as they could be. Then that is something that life coaching, uh, I believe could really benefit you with. Because in life coaching, we um, are definitely more present and future oriented, um, although we will go back into the past and revisit maybe areas where you got stuck and um, maybe areas of great pain and um, kind of gain whatever wisdom and insight we are can learn from those experiences and accept whatever it is that happened in the past. But we won't spend a ton of time, you know, analyzing and identifying what it is that's in the past we're gonna go back there, revisit it, and then think about how can we, you know, be mindful right here in the present moment, and how can we look towards the future to kind of be the best person we could possibly be. A term that is called self-actualization. And in women's work, I really like to call this stepping into your true goddess potential or embodying the goddess. And of course, that's not limited to uh, just women. And so life coaching is really more about growing the flowers of life as opposed to, you know, pulling the weeds. Although there will be a little bit of weed pulling as well. Um, an important distinction, though, is that, again, you know, if you do think you have a clinical issue, something that requires a diagnosis, that is not necessarily appropriate for, for coaching. You can certainly get coaching but you should also be getting, um, you know, clinical mental health services. Now, if that sounds like something that could benefit you, um, you know, I would love to encourage you to take that step and kind of um, take the step of self-actualization and finding really your true path in life. Because it is my belief that if we gain insight and awareness and build healthy habits, and um, evaluate our important values in life, then we can truly bloom. And life can go from just, you know, the daily mundane to um, a very beautiful spiritual experience. So, but that being said, as a life coach, I cannot promise you any kind of quick transformation, any kind of, uh, you know, very quick turnaround, because really, the beautiful thing about all this is that the power is in your hands. All that I can truly offer you is um, building awareness, building insight, um, looking towards what are my biggest gifts in this life and how can I use those gifts? And then also, you know, uh, motivating you and walking that path with you and not shying away when you are having a difficult time. But the real, real work lies in you doing the work. 
So that's also, uh, it's both exciting and scary, like most things in life, like most good things in life. So if that sounds like something that you are interested in, um, you know, please do contact me through Women's Base and we can set up a meeting. Uh, I do see adults, so 18 and up. However, you know, if you feel like this is the right thing for you and you're ready for this deep, personal, transformational work, I could certainly make an exception if, you know, we speak and have a conversation. Um, and I see both men and women or any gender expression, um, you know, more than welcome. So I would love to have you as my client if you feel that this is the right fit for you and you feel like you got something out of this video. Um, it was great to meet you and I hope you have a beautiful, beautiful day.